Everyone welcome Melody to the show. Now, when Melody was a teen, she dreamed about the day she would finally find and come face to face with her biological father. All she had was a name. It was Marjo. That was the name. Four years ago, Melody believed her dream came true when she found a man named Marjo on Facebook. <laughs> Immediately, she booked a flight to go see him. And when they finally met, Melody claims that Marjo hugged her and then said, you don't look anything like me. <laughs> that, that was four years ago. What's it been like since then? Hell, I can't, there's not, you can't put it into words exactly. So I, he blocked me. He won't talk to me. I just want to know if he's my father. I mean, I don't really want him in my okay. life. Okay. So, obviously, we gave him a paternity test. Do you think he's the right man? Yes, I do. We look too much alike. Our facial features are too much alike. Why then would he say when he saw you that you don't look like him? Ignorance. Yeah. Ignorance. I mean, it's... There's a, that's the only word to describe it. I mean, 37 years, seriously. If you did not want the responsibility of a child, there's condoms, wrap it. I mean, seriously, come on. You don't want children, wrap it. You have no idea what it does to a child to have her father deny her 37 years. All you gotta do is just step up, and he never did, he never stepped up. I mean, I have so much hatred, so much anger for this man. Let's go back. You first heard the name Marjo. At I the age of 15. At the age of 15. 15. And I just, the funniest part about it is, is the only reason why I know I've got the right man. Ever since I was the age of 15, I constantly asked my mother, and she will tell you the same thing. Every single time I asked her who was my father, her story never changed. Marjo, 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 Marjo. Now, come on. If a woman was not seriously, if a woman did not know who the father of her child was, is, why would the same name pop up in her mouth? Your mom is in the audience. Yes. Do you hold her no, response? Very, I love her dearly. She's at least trying to make it. My mom is trying to make the effort in being in my life. If I have my mother's number, I can sit there, text her, Mom, I need to talk. She wasn't Bam, there when she, you were growing up much. She was in and out, that I will admit. She was there in and out. But you know what? She at least made the effort. She didn't poof. Right. OK, <laughs> Sheila. When you got pregnant, you didn't contact Marjo, did you? No, I didn't, because I didn't even know I was pregnant until I was about six weeks long. And then did you try to find him or not? Not until maybe years later, I asked family members about it. Right. And I even, they, I had pictures of, of so my daughter. So you're positive that Marjo is oh, her yes. father? Yes, because he's, he's maybe the first <laughs> one that I accepted. In fact, this morning before I even this morning, before I even got on the flight in Omaha, my first text message this morning was my mother, good morning, sweetie. Aww. My mom is trying to make the effort in being in my life. And the worst part about it is, is when this DNA test comes back that he is my father, I don't want him there. What? I don't want him there. You don't want I've him in gone your life? Hit, Maury, I have gone 37 years without this man in my that, life. That, yeah, you better rethink. And he's not, I know darn well. You might well. want to rethink that. I, I'm not sure. So we're going to hear Marjo's side of the story. But before, before he comes, understand. yeah, before he comes out, before he comes out, take a look at this. I have three words for Melody, not my daughter. First of all, her mother, Sheila, was a hoe. She was sleeping with the whole block. I didn't even know Sheila had a kid. They waited almost 40 years to tell me anything. When I first looked at Melanie, I knew she was not my kid. I didn't like the way she walked, I didn't like the way she talked, and I definitely didn't like the way she looked. I don't know what Melanie wants for me, but this feels like a setup. Sheila should have kept her legs closed, and we wouldn't be in this mess. When they find out I'm not the father, I want them to leave me alone. She's not my kid, and she's not my problem. Everybody, 
Here's Marjo. So you gonna get pregnant? She's gonna have you or not kill me uh, for my whole you life? You knew. You knew. No, I did not. Yes, you did. You're full. Of really? The How do I not look like you? Marjo, so you met her. You wanted to meet her. You met her. When yes. she first called me yep. and told me, she told me she was living in a tent, Murray. You I live in the shed. I was living I in the shed. I have my own place. That's now. fine. Yeah, Where do you live? What the shed? Shut up! Tell me that. I sat there. Literally, if you were not my mother, if she was a why would she mention your name for the ever since I was 15? If she was a hoe, then how come every time okay, I asked second. her about who you I were got it, I got at it. the age of 15, your name came up? Yeah. Your name! Right. Nobody Melody, else's name got I understand. yours. Melody, Step I got, up and wrap it. I want, I want to talk to him. So, Marjo, what yes, you're sir. saying is you were never told that Sheila was pregnant. She admits it, too, that she didn't tell you right away. Yes, sir. But you were with her. I was with her for a few... Uh, Few hits and that was it. it I, had a, I had a wife and kids, it takes Murray. One time. I know that. And I, you you know. Know. What the hell are you trying to tell me something for? I, I know got it. two kids. You were not there. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Who did you conceive? Hello. Not, not I'm right got here. It. I got it. And the only thing no. I want out I got of this, it. I got it. when this DNA test comes back that you are my father, all I want out of you is acknowledgement. Marjo. You want to get in her life if you're the father? No, Murray. You don't. I tried. I tried to. No. 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 You want to make sure that he's proven to be your father, yes. and then you don't want to have anything to do with him? Honestly, no. Why would I want anything to do with a man who wants to sit there and deny me for 37 years? But maybe... 37. You have missed birthdays. You but, have but missed Melody, childbirths. Melody, maybe if I prove to him that he's your father... You really think he's going to... He ain't going to step up. He's nothing but a low life. Oh. Marjo. Marjo. Oh, you want to know the answers, don't you? Yes, sir, I really We're do. We're going to find out right now. Yeah. In the case of 37-year-old Melody, Marjo, you are not. Oh, thank you! Thank you! I told you! I'm the bad guy! No! Sheila, come here. Any other person that you might want to bring to the show? That I'm not even really for sure. <laughs> I'm sorry, Melanie. I'm sorry. All right, get dude, out of that's my what face. you feel. All right, good. Get I'm out of my face. I'll let you get out of your face. I'm, but I'm sorry. Have you been told that you're the father, but fear you're actually raising another man's child? Please call us right now at 1 888 45 Mari to speak with someone from our show about taking a DNA test. Thanks for watching, everybody. Now, if you want to see more Mari content, click here. And be sure to subscribe to be the first to know about new videos.